So you treat bad breath successfully. How? We have something, we have a dedicated center at the office called the Richter Center for Halitosis or Bad Breath. We get bad breath patients who come in. We've had patients come in from Africa, from New York. They come in from all over the world. They don't care about their gum disease, but they care about bad breath. It's really very funny. And we treat, we treat bad breath. Sometimes it's caused by gum disease. In those cases, we treat the gum disease and get rid of it. We get rid of it, sometimes using the laser, but primarily by eliminating the cause, which is bacteria. Okay. Sometimes it's bacteria under the gums causing gum disease, but more often it's bacteria in a certain part of the tongue that have to be removed and eliminated and patients taught how to prevent those bacteria from growing back again. So like, what do you do? Is it a rinse? We have what's called a, well, actually we, the patients come in, we test them first to make sure they have bad breath. Believe it or not, a lot of people who are sure they have bad breath don't, but they have social problems that they think they have bad breath. But a lot of people do have bad breath. Okay. Very, this is crazy, but a lot of the people who really have bad breath, they don't know they have bad they breath. Know. They have to be sent by somebody. The people who are sure they have bad breath, very often they don't have it. They just think they have it. So we have to differentiate whether they have it or not. Now, sometimes they don't have it, but they still want to have the treatment just to feel better anyway. Okay. So. What we do is first we test them to check it, and then we actually use what's called a, like, it's like a high-powered power spray to spray and eliminate these bacteria deep in the tongue and get rid of these bacteria that actually convert uh, uh, things in the saliva or postnasal drips to hydrogen sulfide gas, which causes bad breath. So we eliminate these bacteria, and then we teach the patient how to prevent these bacteria from coming back. And additionally, we give them something to rinse with that will kill any remaining bacteria that they may have missed. So actually, if they have bad breath, we have to eliminate the cause of the bad breath, which is bacteria. It may be bacteria under the gum, in which case we treat the gum disease, or it may, bac may be bacteria in a certain part of the tongue, in which case we have to eliminate those. We eliminate those by using a power spray that goes deep into the tongue. You spray it on the tongue. It's like a high-powered spray, and we also scrape the tongue very thoroughly to remove all of these bacteria. Okay. We then teach the patient how to prevent these bacteria from coming back, and we give them something that will, to rinse with it, will kill any remaining bacteria, and it's like turning off a faucet. It's just like, you turn this off, you never have bad breath again. Really? It's, it's amazing. I, no, it's amazing because I know people that I've treated personally and it's like, and you don't even have morning breath. You don't even have more. If you do this, there is no, I know it sounds too good to be true, yeah. but it actually is. There's no morning breath. There's no bad breath. It's gone. It's done. Finished. And that's the end of it. And I can't think of any patient where we've actually had a failure because if a patient thinks they still have bad breath, we always ask them, we have them come back to be retested to make sure it's gone. And if they think they still have, have it, we say, well, okay, just let us talk to somebody who can verify it, that you have it, and, and we can find out what the circumstances were. We've never, ever, ever had a patient being able to bring somebody who said, yeah, they still have bad breath. So, so it's a bacteria that's living on the tongue. Yeah. Or a bacteria that's living under the gum line. Exactly, that's Is it. Is that right? You get rid of the bacteria, you get rid of the bad breath, but like, now, done. Over. And it could stay away for quite some time. Period. No, it's per oh. you have to do what you have to do at home. You do what you have to do at home. You never have bad breath again.